I don't know if you all heard the news about uh, Penthouse Magazine. Uh, the company that owns Penthouse Magazine filed for bankruptcy. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I, I, and this magazine's been around forever. Andy, uh, I, I didn't, wasn't sure if I should mention this or not, but didn't you have stock in the Penthouse Company? Yeah, uh, it's kind of a bummer for me, and I, I actually just got the letter from the CEO about the whole deal. You got a letter from the CEO yeah. of Penthouse? What does it, what does it say? Well, it's kind of like technical stock stuff, but I don't know. It's, I, it's, it's interesting, at least. Let me Check it out. read it for you. Dear Penthouse Investor, I never thought this would happen to us. Last night, we were working late when our chief financial officer approached us with his staff and said, check this out. In his hand was a seven-inch thick spreadsheet that exposed all the gaping financial holes in our once proud firm. We took a real pounding in the last quarter, he said in a low, husky voice, and we'll be slammed even harder this time if we don't put our assets on the street right now. I was worried about a premature liquidation. He said, premature? We should have pulled out months ago. My knees buckled as I imagined our stock plunging further downward and gallons of red ink coating our bottom line. So we quit. Sincerely, Penthouse Publications. Wow. I got it. It's a bummer. It's exciting. I'm out like 60 bucks. <laughs> you lost $60.